Good morning, folks. Welcome back. Hope you're all doing well. We're doing well. It's uh, back up to 50, 60 degrees, which is uh, awesome. But this week, we might have some calves. Starting calving here this week, potentially. So we sorted off our heavy heifers, ones that were starting to bag down, ones whose vulvas looked a little loose that we thought could calve sometime soon. We put them in the lot. We've got the rest of the heifers who aren't quite ready. Still out on some pasture. You can see them over there. They're uh, ready for some cake. But yeah, pretty exciting. It's going to be some beautiful weather. So I hope the calves come. I hope they just all calf. That'd be all right. We get them done. We got two weeks here of good weather. I don't know what it's going to do after that, but looks really nice in the forecast. So we're really grateful for that. It was a pretty cold stretch there for a bit. Um, I know some of you were wondering what we did with that cow who died. We, uh, we shot her, you know, we put her down, but we weren't able to butcher her or anything. There's, it's almost impossible to get into a butcher shop without months, without a slot months and months ahead of time. Um, we could have done it ourselves, but we just didn't have time. It was too cold. We had to feed cows. We just couldn't get her done, but that's all right. It's just the way it is. But yeah, it should be another beautiful day. took Trump into the vet the other day. We we're gonna take his eye out. We got some really good news. The vet actually looked at it and said, the um, tumor is going away. So Trump doesn't have to lose his eye. He gets to keep it for now. And uh, you know, the cancer could always come back, but for now his cancer is going away. So we're just gonna keep giving him what we've been giving him. And um, really, really, really happy that he gets to keep his eye. My dad also got a new little puppy, little bug. Bug, come here. Come here. Yeah, she's pretty cute. It's gonna be another little working dog, so <laughs> it'll be uh, it'll be fun to have her around. Angus is pretty happy to have her to play with. My parents' other dog is kind of a stick in the mud. He doesn't like to play. He's just grumpy. So little bug is a nice addition to the ranch. We've spent the last couple of days getting our calving barn already. Um, our heifers. Like I said, they might start this week. It's not for sure, but for sure next week, they'll be getting it into it pretty good. Our cows still have a few weeks to go. So uh, yeah, we just gotta get everything ready. But basically we pulled out all the old sawdust out of our barns and put in some new sawdust in all three barns. And we gotta figure out something to do with these little mini ponies for the winter when we put some, some uh, cows in here. What do you think of them, Angus? kind of weird but this little one here is actually silas's we got him a little saddle i'll have to show you guys leave him alone and uh yeah it'll be fun to have him have him ride around on come on angus let's go come on come on let's go so today we are going to work some cows we got to give them some free calving shots we worked about 200 head yesterday. We try and get this group done today. If we get them done, we'll probably try and do another group. But yeah, just normal pre-calving shots. I'll get into it when we get over there. But uh, just stuff, you want your calves to be healthy. When they're born, you want your cows to be healthy. So it's a beautiful day to work them. Hopefully they'll work fine. But me and Jock are over here. We're just gonna get them started moving that direction over to the feedlot where we're gonna work them. We got, I don't know, maybe a half mile to a mile to move them. Not too far. Girls, let's go through the gate. Come on. Turn around through the gate with the rest. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. There we go.
Today we are given three different shots. One is just vitamin A and D. The other two are for the calf, which will actually be passed on to the calf through the mother of the milk. One is for overeating and the other is for scours. One, two, three, four, uno mas, five, six, that all works. Up in there. Come on, load up in there. Let's go. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. Load up. Load up. Load up. Come on. Come on in there. gonna have a little extra help this afternoon <laughs> you look pretty sleepy to work cows bud huh are you ready to go to work uh. yeah okay look at the cows over there hi. you say hi what's the cow say do you remember moo Moo. You remember? Need to wake up first. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, ah. there they are. Okay. Hi cows. You wanna give us a pregnancy update, honey? Yeah. I'm still pregnant. <laughs> yeah. Oh. But all ready, right? Yeah. Ready to have it? Yeah. Anxiously waiting. Yes. What date did you guess? The 9th. The 9th, February 9th. And do the 15th. Do the 15th. So just a couple more weeks. <laughs> yep. Yeah. We'll see. Bubby's giving you some words of encouragement. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Are you ready to have a little sibling, bud? Uh, no. No? You want yeah. all the attention? I'm sure. I'm sure. Uh, Should we get to work? Hey. Hey. You see the cows? Don't give this one a slow. What do you think? Yeah. What does the cow say? Yeah. You say moo. Carson looks as if it's just got some food in the corner.
You have a lot to say. I think you'll be talking in the back of this entire video. <laughs> What's wrong? Just say hi. 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 You hold it. Can you hold it. Yeah. Hold it. Good job. Ah, yeah, yeah. Well, we are all done working cows. Feels really good. It's a perfect, perfect evening. Just turning them back out to some pasture. Going to stay here for just another couple days and we're going to bring them all really close to home for when we start calving. Which for the cows, it'll be probably three weeks, three more weeks. Heifers. Should really start coming next week, but there'll be a couple calves probably this week. I looked at them earlier and there's some that are really begging down. Vulvas are really loose, so they seem to be getting pretty close, but cows are a little bit behind, behind the heifers. Not behind where we want them to be, but just behind the heifers, so. Yep, it's a good feeling. Good feeling to be done working them. Guys, thanks a lot for coming along today. I hope you all are doing well. We'll be back very soon. See you in the next one.